peace be to you today we reflect the passage of women caught in adultery jesus was preaching on the temple region the jews and the elders always somehow wanted to trap jesus through his words or actions so that they can cut hold of him arrest him and kill him so they used a lot of traps especially in the earlier times they were asking about the tribute tribute to be offered to the roman government he brought to the coin and given the solution similarly here they brought a woman caught in adultery here he has to say follow the law of moses or don't follow when they were all they were persisting on jesus that this woman had to be killed and probably john 18 11 read the jews were deprived of carrying out any death penalty regarding the religious laws so they were deprived of the death penalty and they wanted to trap jesus to be in this puzzle region to put him into difficulty so they asked him permission to kill that woman jesus started to write something on the ground and jeremiah 17th chapter we read all those who turn away from the lord they will be written on the earth so by writing on the ground he directly made a signal that they were also guilty of their own sins and jesus when they were put persisting on jesus to give his verdict jesus said those who did not have sin guilt of sin can throw their stones on this woman this was a very categorical statement it went and touched everyone's conscience they were not able to answer because they were standing before the lord who knows the heart and mind of the people he touched their hearts he had triggered their conscience finally from last to the last to the first everyone went away and jesus looking at the woman said neither i would punish you but go but do not sin again dear brothers and sisters in christ jesus jesus was always making clear the way making clear the erroneous laws he was giving support to the sinners by giving support to the sinners he was paving the way that they all become saints let us be part of jesus ministry heavenly father we thank and praise you for all the gifts you have showered upon us 
Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. Be with us, strengthen us, heal us, Lord, for we are your children. Help us to be your children, your beloved sons, so that in realize our mistakes, we may be careful in judging the others. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen.